Hello, it's your boy David. Off a few months ago, my, my phone broke, so I bought a new Google Pixel 3, unboxed it, and I got it on sale actually, like 100, 200 pounds off, I think, 150 pounds, I think, off, I think, on sale. It was the last day of the sale when I got it, so it was definitely worth getting for the price at the time. And part of the offer was they gave me 75 pounds free Google Store credits. Now, that is not Google Play credits. Google Play credits, I thought that's what it was. So I was trying to buy movies with it. You can buy movies on there, games, apps. I was trying to buy movies on there and I couldn't. And I was like, where's my voucher? Where's my voucher? But it's on Google Store, not Google Play Store. There's a difference. Google Play Store is the app store for Android. And Google Store is Google's main store. They sell phones, accessories, and a few other things. So I bought one of those few other things because I had the voucher and I, it was going to expire like in a few days, I think, from now. No, actually, 1st of May. 1st of May expired. So on the 30th, I was like, you know what, i got to buy something. So I bought something that cost £99, £75 voucher, so £24. £24 for a £100 product. It's not too bad. Not too bad. So uh, this is the package. But what is it? Well, it's in the title, actually. So you know what it is. Anyway, let's open it. In the bag, we have a box. Who's calling the house? God damn it. Yeah, I don't answer it. I put it on silent. Can't disturb my videos, can you? Anyway, we have got, uh, inside the box, we've got another box. Yeah, we've got a white box out of a brown box. Dream with your eyes open, says Google. So basically what it's telling me to do is daydream. I guess daydreaming is a good thing. I was told as a kid it's a bad thing. So we have got Google Daydream View. Virtual reality. I've already got one actually. I got PSVR. I haven't used it yet, actually, but it's, it's, it's behind me somewhere. I'm gonna use that soon. I'm gonna play on it. But I bought another VR headset this time on Google because there was nothing much else to buy really. I didn't want to buy phone covers or a new phone or anything else. I just wanted to buy it. This is only it. This is it. Like, let me just double check like what was on there. So they have phones, obviously, they have tablets, they have laptops. They have a connected home thing, so I have one already called Alexa. She couldn't even hear me there. What happened? Is she broken? Anyway, uh, one of those, but the Google one, whatever that's one. What's it called again? Cortana, isn't it? Isn't that the Google one? I don't know. W whatever the Google one is, they have that on the store. They've got virtual reality, phone accessories, and... Uh, headphones? What's that? Camera four-pack bundle. They have CCTV cameras. You can buy six for a grand. Better be flipping 4K for that price, jeez. Yeah, so that's it, yeah, that's it really. You have cameras <laughs> that are CCTV basically. You have smoke alarms, Google smoke alarms. <laughs> and you have uh, these other things. And you have this. Which was the only thing that was interesting, so I thought I'd just buy this. £24, £500 thing, so I thought, you know what, it's a good offer. So uh, I bought it, let me, just, let me just open it now. It opened similar to the Pixel 3. I did an unboxing for that as well, uh, previously. Alright, so in the lid, we have got... This is really easy to open. Like, literally every single thing has been easy to open. It's not felt too secure. Then again, why am I complaining? Because it's better than flipping gaffer tape over it. Okay, there's a remote for the VR, I assume. And this, this is the VR headset. It looks interesting to say the least. There is no, there is no wires or there is a book, there is, There's no wires. So I had to download an app uh, to uh, install it and it says the remote's not charged. Like, it's charging now with my phone charger, so... Yeah, we'll give it about 10 years, so I'll see you then. Several bad puns later. Alright, so it's set up now. 
and it's done through the app so you put the phone on there I assume so let me just see if I can do that uh, if I'm smart enough which I'm not I'm stupid so watch me fail uh, I think it just goes there I think that's it it's done through Bluetooth by the way it's through Bluetooth you connect through Bluetooth so uh, I think that's it I think that's how you do it hang on a second let me just close that up and uh, yeah let's see where the magic takes me. Sorry I can't show you what's in there actually because uh, I can't record it. I need HDMI connection. Even if I had one though, the wire would be over there. It'd be connected there and it's on the left. So I don't think the wire would. I think it'd be a bit awkward with a wire like tangling in front of me. But um, anyway, I'm gonna like see what it's like. It basically just, you, you can imagine what it's like. Let's just put it that way, come on. All right, well. Where's the remote? Right. Okay, this looks... This this looks surreal. Oi! Press the daydream... Which one's the daydream button? Oh, well, it's gone black, it's gone black. Okay. Okay. You can watch... You can watch movies. Wait, you can watch movies. How do I... How do I go left and right? Yes. Holy moly. I'm doing something. I just opened the movies app. I don't know if there's games on here, but... I've opened the movie app. Okay, wait. Um... How do I point it? The pointing is so weird. Right, here's my library. Aquaman, Jurassic World. Right, let me just get uh, Infinity War up. Oi! Oi! Yeah, there we go. You can't even see what I'm doing, but it's kind of cool. Oh my god. So there's a screen in front of me, right, showing Infinity War, and around me is just space. I'm in space. I'm in space watching Infinity War. This makes no sense. This makes no sense whatsoever. Alright, let me just go back. I have to put a remote next to my chest for some reason. Doesn't make any sense. Alright, let me just, how do I close that? I'm in a house! I'm in a house! I see a garden behind. I see a pot. There's a T-Rex. It's not real, it's, it's like a model T-Rex. I see yellow and brown scarf. I'm pretty sure that's Harry Potter, but I do, I do support all for Nairfell, which we wear the same colors. Behind me is a tricycle picture. Why is there a tricycle food? Do I have a child in this universe or what's, what's going on here? There's... I see the Titanic. The Titanic is sinking. It's, it's halfway sinking. I'm not going to get up and walk because I'm pretty sure I'd smash the TV. How do I close this app? I don't know! Where's the camera? I'm going to assume I'm looking. Oh. You're here. How do I exit the app? I'm still on the movies app. Why does it have to be here? I don't want to explore the library. I don't know how to exit the app. It was a bit awkward now. So that is my first experience of virtual reality. It was interesting. I just feel like a game would be crazy at this. But I would have to like find a way to record it as well. I want to like record it. But I can imagine like how sick it would be in PlayStation VR. I want me I want to play that now. I'm going to, I'm going to play I'm, I'm going to play it at some point PSVR, not this, but my PlayStation VR. I'm going to play that. I got like a lot of games bought already, so I'm ready to like ready to go with that console. But um 
I can't explain it unless you've done it already, unless you've done virtual reality before. But it's like you're in something. You're like you're in something, which, which is pretty cool. So I was just I was watching Infinity War <laughs> on on like a miniature like fictional screen, and I was in space floating for some reason. So yeah, that was that. So yeah, uh, that's all I got to say really. Um, sorry, that wasn't like a great last five last few minutes because you can't even see what I was doing. But um, yeah, I, I don't know how I'd record it. This is your boy Davidoff. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and see ya.